But president, there is a way that a president can conduct himself. There is a way that the president can conduct himself. And for your own information, the president must mirror the republic. He must mirror what kind of a country that we are as Zambians. The president must mirror and show exemplary behavior, conduct, both in deeds and in words. But what we are beginning to see now that we have a president who feels is the Alpha and Omega and he can do as he wishes and he can use any palatable language towards others. It is not good. Today in Mansa, the president, again, telling lies. Yes, we know that there were certain incidences of, of, of violence under PF. But to go to Mansa and say, every time HH came here, there was violence. And to go and use a very bad uh, 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 language, very bad word, to say every time HH came here, Bale Muponona. A president at a public meeting using that kind of word. Mweba mnina ne mweba chita advise wa president. Tuwa mwene do bala ndile kukasa mwabaya tukana ulu sile papabli klari at it was a mistake. But this man has continued. The next time we, thing we heard was that ukukutumba. Abantu wa chita condemned, the church is condemned, everybody condemned and said, no, 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 it's unpresidential to do this. Even lawyers condemned, churches condemned. Again, today we are present, kutu mwaya imini na kuma and sale elo, ukiala nda, you don't say church nga isabale muponona. Do you know the meaning of the word ukuponona? Do you know the meaning of the word ukuponona mwewe na Zambia? Ichwe mba chitaila, kolwa shila wengwa. Enda na ponona. Koloya shila wengwa. Enda na ponona. Ukuponona means pulling the foreskin of the penis backwards. That's the meaning of ukuponona. So haba itenga baleba, nde kuponona, they simply mean nka kutonsa, nka ndaya kunshi, ukuibwesha kunuma. Is that the language that the president must go and speak proudly at a public meeting. Ah, please. Please. To a papa tasana by a church. Na imumwe bantumu atota. Kulube mba umuntu wa isa tukano rusele lwa kulefyo. Mwala atota no kutota. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. And the president must not be the first one to encourage lawlessness. How does the president go and at a public rally go and recognize Chavinga as leader of the opposition? Mm. But president, you are promoting lawlessness. This matter concerning Chavinga is in court. And I don't think you as president of the Republic of Zambia would be in the forefront to recognize somebody who has been appointed under very, very, very suspicious and illegal circumstances. Supposing this had happened to the UPND, would you be happy for, uh, for any other government to recognize Ch Chavimba? Chavinga as leader of the opposition under the circumstances. No, our president, our president, save us the embarrassment. Chavinga is not leader of the opposition in parliament. And even if you feel so strongly about it, because I know you and Chavinga are, are, are buddies, you are very good friends, please avoid bringing that kind of thing to the general public. Because people will lose confidence. What are you telling the judges? You are putting the judges in an awkward situation. Because if the president is pronouncing that this is the leader of the opposition, what are you trying to say? You remember when President Edgar Lunga at one time in, in uh, Solwezi 
uh, said, whoever is going to rule against me, blah, blah, blah. You condemned it so much and said, when a matter is in court, leave it to the courts to decide. But so what has gone wrong with you, Pres President Hagainde Ichlema? What has just gone wrong with you? Why are you behaving in this particular manner? Just why, my brother? Yeah. Ah, we bane. Uyumule leta mchalo muse vanya. Muse vanya ukala mbasana. Chavinga is not leader of the opposition. And it was wrong for you as president at a public meeting to recognize him as such. You know the provisions of Article 74 too. Our leader of government is elected. And you know for sure that what Mao Sampa did, the so-called uh, 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 general conference, is a sham of a general conference. It has got no legal uh, basis to stand on. And above all, you know that there is a principle of uh, subjudice. Why would you want to go and start uh, you know, commenting on matters that are in court in public as president. You are simply telling the people of Zambia that all of us must start being, uh, behaving in a way that we promote law lawlessness. No, but president, you can do better. You can do better. You see, before you became president, these are some of the things that people complained. This man is like this, this man is like this. You went and insulted the northern province. People forgave you. Again, today, Mwaya to Kanakulua Pula province. Nombo mwa na imuinga kesa mkulanda in your presence. Adwa president nari mpono na ulia. Mkonfashan. Are you going to be happy with that? Ah, weba. Nimuila chitefi ba HH. You can do better. You can do better. Stop it. You owe the Zambian people an apology. You owe the judicial an apology. You owe the judge an apology for recognizing Chavinga as leader of the opposition. No wonder even the speaker is behaving like this. Because if this is coming from the head of state, what do you expect the speaker? How do you expect the speaker to behave? However, President, some of these things you can avoid them. Please don't bring shame to that office of the president. It is a very respected office. But you are devaluing the, this office by your conduct. If you don't know Bemba very well, please ask us. But I know you know what it means. That was deliberate. And what you were saying is not true. Tell us when you were beaten in Wapula province. Because the, 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 these boys use that word to try and to, 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 to mean that you were, it's beating somebody. But the actual meaning is what I've told you. Ukuponona is pulling the foreskin of the penis. And you can't go and use that language in public. HH vale muponona. Ngai sakuno HH kuponona. Kuponoka. Even if you meant to say beating, but when were you ever beaten in Wapula province? Why do you want to inculcate hate in the minds of the people? Why? And your behavior is, 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 is very selective. Right now, in southern province today, Mr. President, every time there is a by-election, the opposition are failing to file nominations. The candidates are chased and beaten. You don't talk about it. You don't talk about it. But you go to Luapula and lie that every time HH came, he was being beaten. I remember very well in 2015, 2016, we were campaigning freely. You were also holding a lot of rallies in Wapula province. Nobody beat you. Nobody chased you. But there was a problem because I said, and I want to say it again, 
I condemned when they said that because of COVID, people must not be allowed to, con to have public rallies. I condemned that one. Despite being PF, I said, no, you cannot hold an election without campaigns. And learn something from this. When you do certain things to try and get at others, that thing will turn around and haunt you. So stop lying, the president. How can we have a lying president? When were you ever beaten in Wapula province? Show us a video or show us a newspaper caption where HH was beaten in Mansa for you to go and stand at a platform and say, every time we came here, we were beaten. No, one Tuleke. But President Ubufi Tuleke. It's not building anybody.